Hi, this is Mike Hallahan, Dr. FileFinder, and welcome to your Butterscotch.com tutorial on what is a motherboard. This is a picture of a motherboard. Motherboard is basically the foundation that your computer is built on. This right here is the socket where your central processing unit or CPU gets plugged in. These are expansion slots where you can put in cards that will give your computer other functions. The very early motherboards, and here's one from Commodore from 1982, the same year the personal computer was released by IBM. Motherboard's a printed circuit board, so you can see the printed circuits on it. You can see some little chips. Here's the processing unit over here, but it's really very simple. In the early motherboards, you had to install all of the facilities for peripherals like floppy disks, hard disks, and everything else. Sound, graphics. If you look at a motherboard from just 10 years later in 1992, you can see that there's a lot more going on here. There's more capacitors and resistors, more chips, bigger processor. The thing is, is that today's motherboards take on a whole range of functions by providing the sound, the graphics, the drivers for the hard drive, floppy drive, DVD drives, and lots more. So the motherboard of a computer is the basis, the foundation, and everything else that goes into what makes up your computer rests and is installed on that motherboard. So that's a motherboard and that's all there is to it. 